Okay, so hey guys, welcome back to another sport this week video. And in today's video, I've got ice hockey, basketball, NFL, football, cricket, rugby, boxing, UFC, and Formula One news. If you are new around here though and you haven't subscribed, please do so. Like if you do need live here, and let's get straight into it. So I'm going to start off with the ice hockey news. Moving on, oh uh, well, starting off, Bruins lost 4-3 versus Knights. Canadians lost 7-6 versus Canucks. Red Wings won 4-2 versus Lightning. Maple Leafs won 4-0 versus Stars. Canadians won 4-2 versus Kraken. Bruins won 4 0 uh, versus Avalanche. Maple Leafs won 5 0 versus Kings. Red Wings lost 5 1 versus Panthers. Bruins lost 4 3 versus Coyotes. Red Wings won 3 2 versus Stars. Maple Leafs won 5 4 versus Flames. And Canadians lost 4 2 versus Kings. And that is all the ice hockey news. Moving on to the basketball news now. Celtics 116 110 versus Raptors. Heat lost 101 93 versus Grizzlies. Warriors lost 112 104 versus Pacers. Lakers lost 116 22 vs Cavaliers. Heat lost 116 96 vs Pistons. Lakers lost 126 113 vs Raptors. Warriors lost 124 123 vs Jazz. Celtics 125 98 vs Suns. Heat 115 110 vs Clippers. Lakers lost 133 122 vs 76ers. Heat lost 115 111 vs Suns. Warriors 123 107 vs Celtics. And Lakers 124 117 vs Pistons. And that is all the basketball news. Moving on to the NFL news now. Buccaneers won 17 16 vs Saints. Rams won 17 16 vs Raiders. Rams claimed Mayfield. Miller is out for the season. Ridder has named a starter. Chiefs won 34 to 28 versus Broncos, and Buccaneers lost 35 to 7 versus 49ers. And that is all the NFL news. Moving on to the football news now. Croatia won 3-1 on pens after drawing 1-1 versus Japan. Brazil won 4-1 versus South Korea. Morocco won 3-0 on pens after drawing 0-0 versus Spain. Portugal won 6-1 versus Switzerland. Hazard has retired from international football. O'Neill is the new Northern Ireland manager. Enrique has stepped down as Spain manager. Daly won player of the month. Hayes and Reddy won manager of the month. Argentina won 4-3 on pens after drawing 2-2 versus Netherlands. Croatia won 4-2 on pens after drawing 1-1 versus Brazil. Tite has stepped down as Brazil manager. Morocco won 1-0 versus Portugal. And France won 2-1 versus England, which, I mean, I don't really want to speak too much about that. But, I mean, overall, as a whole, the week has been an interesting week in the World Cup. A lot of upsets and a lot of big wins and... Uh, yeah, hopefully for another good week, as I believe it's the last week next week, so I believe next week I'll be talking about the final and who wins it. Moving on to the cricket news now. England won by 74 runs versus Pakistan, which is a big result for them. Bangladesh won by 5 runs versus India, and India won by 227 runs versus Bangladesh, and that is all the cricket news. Moving on to the rugby news now, and it is only Jones has been sacked as England head coach. And now moving on to the boxing news. Taylor versus Swarms, Taylor versus Virgo, Ordway versus Brooke. Fournier versus Krista Dulu will fight on the 14th of January. McKinson versus Ariaza will fight on the 17th of December. Hughes has joined a matchroom. Froch is in the Hall of Fame. Charlo will fight Suzuyu on the 28th of January. Matisse has joined a matchroom. McNamara won by points versus Ahmed. Bostam won by K in round 5 versus Glynos. O'Regan won by TK in round 3 versus Rodriguez. Price won by points versus Santana. Courtenay won by points versus Rueg. Cash won by points versus Neves. Dixon won by points versus Shergold. Metcalf won by stoppage in round 6 versus Pennington's remain a WBA Continental Super Worldweight Champion. Bridges won by TK in round 10 versus O'Connell to remain IBF World Bantamweight Champion, which I did predict right. Uh, Lopez won via majority decision versus Warrington to become IBF World Featherweight Champion, which I did predict. I believe it was a stoppage I predicted, but I still believe that Lopez was win, and I predicted that right. Uh, and a big win for him. Crawford won via Unam, uh, won by KO in round 6 versus Avanesian to remain a WBO World Worldweight Champion, which I did predict that Crawford would win. Conlan won via TK in round 1 versus Guerfi, and that is all the boxing news. Moving on to the UFC news now. Dillashaw has retired. Curtis won via K in round 2 versus Buckley. Shabazian won via K in round 2 versus Lundjambula. Rosenstruck won via K in round, two, round 1 versus Dorkhouse. Rosas Jr. won via submission in round 1 versus Perrin. Tapura won via submission in round 2 versus Mitchell. Duplessis won via, stop, uh, won via submission in round 3 versus Till. Ponzini Bio won by K in round 3 versus Morono. Pimblet won by Decision versus Gordon and Blahovic Drew versus Ankalaev, which I mean obviously I didn't predict right, I never really predict a draw. Um but Dana White said that uh Hill versus Texera will be for the lightweight title, the current vacated uh, or vacant lightweight uh, light heavyweight title, 
and uh, so that is a fight to look forward to and I'm sure that means that this fight will be remade again uh, and overall a good card, an interesting card, shame about Till losing really, I do like Till as a fighter uh, Pimblet, big win for him, congratulations to him uh, I did like the Rosas Jr. win, that was a big win and uh, good to see him fight and I do seem to, I do quite like him as a fighter coming in as one of the younger fighters in the UFC and yeah that is all the UFC news and moving on to the F1 news where there's only one bit of news and that the Dutch Grand Prix has been extended to 2025 and now moving on to the final sport which is the tennis news Daria, uh, it was the Daria Tennis Cup Severa won, uh, won 2 0 versus TM. Medvedev won 2 0 versus Severa. Sissipas won 2 0 versus Nori. Medvedev won 2 0 versus Warinka. Severa and TM lost 2 0 versus Rublev and Berrettini. Kyrgios and Sissipas lost 2 0 versus Stricker and Herkaz. And Medvedev lost 2 0 versus Fritz. And uh, yeah, that is all the tennis move news. Moving on, um, that is all of it for this week. Hope you did enjoy. Like it if you didn't, like it, subscribe if you're new. And thanks for watching.